Okay, what's going on guys? It's the Average Baller 24. I'm here with my first video. Um, in this I want to discuss a couple things that I don't want 2K to change that might ruin this game. Um, now 2K16, when it first came out, it was a good game. It was fun. The shot meter wasn't like bad or anything. But then things started happening where they patched the shot meter so you couldn't get uh, green releases. You couldn't shoot, like, real well if you didn't have a maxed out jumper. So that's the problem I want to talk about. There's one player build that can really technically shoot threes with, with ease. And that's basically going to be the sharpshooter. Now, for me, that's what my player build is. So I know when I'm saying all this stuff, it's going to be opinionated since I'm kind of this is my build and I want don't want anything to change with it but the thing the thing I'm concerned about is a lot of people are complaining that the sharpshooter is overpowered and for me firsthand since I actually have the player um, for instance I'll show you this I have my stats maxed out for three-point shooting. I have it maxed out for playmaking, defense, layup dunks, all that. So, for me, when I'm in the park, obviously, I'm going to be able to shoot. I'm going to be able to do layups and dunks since it's kind of maxed out. In the but, let me just quickly go over the maxed out stats for these things. So, you can see the maxed out stats for off, off a dribble shot isn't even an 80. And that that's where... You know you're gonna patch the if you patch this play this play style. For instance, I'm a shooting guard sharpshooter. If you if you patch this, number one, it does it won't fit with the three point shooting. I mean a 93 three point shoot shot. Mid range, I got an 80. Layups and dunks. Look, I mean look at the standing dunk, a 48. My layups a 70 and my dunks a 60. So there's nothing even overpowered about that. I'll tell you on the park when I go up for layups, half the time I'm getting blocked. Uh, or I'm like just hitting the front of the rim so what I'm trying to say is the only way you're gonna be this place I was gonna be good is if you actually to make that place all work so what I'm trying to say is my next thing is you can't patch this play style when people are grinding to get a maxed out player and they're grinding to get these badges that they, I mean look at this I have deep range dead eye gold, limitless range gold, but these are all the ones I've had. I got mid range dead eye. These, okay. So gold last year for limitless range was completely overpowered. I mean, you could go deep shot, take the three and drain it. So this year they decided to do. If I show you, they decide to add these right here. We got catch and shoot, corner specialist, limitless range. These are the Hall of Fame badges. So obviously I'm working for them right now. And the limitless range Hall of Fame badge, corner specialist, catch and these are all great badges. And that's my point. If you patch the sharpshooter play, play build, player build, it just won't fit in the game because it will completely contradict limitless range hall of fame badge which is supposed to be better than gold limitless range and that's my point going back to last year gold limitless range was amazing and you need to have to have a maxed out three so that's what i'm trying to come out like this takes a lot of time to get these these badges the only thing i'm confused about is a lot of people i've seen are saying you have to get all five of your main badges to get a max badge like the grand badge and i don't know I have the Sharpshooter Pro, like, it's one hot and far from, and for a short period of time, can almost be automatic. Now, that badge doesn't do anything on the park. That badge only does stuff for my career. So, I don't know if it's because I got these three, Hall of, or I have three Hall of Fame badges, but I'm pretty sure, I thought I heard that you had to get all five to get the badge, like the Grand Pro badge. Uh, maybe not. I'll look in more into it and let you guys know. But that's where I'm trying to say. Like, I mean, look at this. I'm a six foot three, 
195 pound shooting guard and 87 overall which is kind of max for it, it, it's basically max for not having like using all your upgrades I've used all the upgrades I had from the beginning and I got it there and I'll tell you it it isn't overpowered like I'll go on the park and I'll may shoot three threes in a row and knock them all down but then after that I may only make like one out of the next four shots so there's nothing overpowered about it that's making it like let's just say the shot meter this year is good and 2k just please please don't ruin that same with the jump shot creator which right here you have the jump shot creator. you unlock this in my career sometime it's like a connection with coach K that's my point is uh, is you can't patch that because that's something that people work for and they really want like I, I don't know I know this is kind of like a weird video to start my channel off just kind of ranting on about it but I just want 2k to know that for this game to be good keep this play styles kind of how they are right now uh, there's I don't think in general there's an overpowered player build uh, uh, I think if you patch these sharpshooters playmakers all this kind of stuff it won't work because the people that are like centers will be completely unstoppable because <laughs> sharpshooters and uh, what are they called shot creators won't be able to do anything against them so if you want the game to stay balanced keep the stuff the same for now unless there's some major complaints where things are just getting cr completely crazy but I feel like I have the the enough enough knowledge to say that this player build isn't overpowered it's not like I may you're gonna make every single shot you take with it even with these maxed out Hall of Fame badges so I just I'm gonna tag 2k in it every single like that gets on the video will obviously go it'll get notified to 2k so please if you, if anybody watches this make sure to like this video because I need them to know this uh, just so the game is actually fun to play like I've been having a blast on it compared to 2k 16 halfway through the year so hope it stays that way I um, hope you guys enjoyed I'll be back again tomorrow with another video see you guys